I'm Trisha Keen. Right now on your 13 Action News update. Right now, two drivers are under arrest after a deadly crash near Lamb and Karen this morning. That crash killed a 90 year old woman who was a passenger. Both drivers were injured and taken to the hospital. According to Las Vegas Metro Police, one of the drivers didn't yield right away from a stop sign causing that crash. Police say both drivers showed signs of impairment and were arrested. Well, some of UNLV's online programs are among the best in the nation. According to the latest U.S. News and World Education Report, the School of Nursing's online master's program ranks seventh overall, up from 11th place last year. The College of Education placed 35th, entering the top 50 for the first time, and the online bachelor's program in psychology debuted at 26. Well, the pandemic is the reason behind a shakeup in the coaching staff for tonight's Golden Knights game against the St. Louis Blues. The team releasing a statement saying out of an abundance of caution, the coaching staff will be self isolated. General Manager Kelly McCrinnon will be behind the bench along with Henderson Silver Knights coaches. They did not give further details. Danny. Cold and cloudy tonight, but mostly dry. Our highs were capped in the mid 40s, 10 to 15 degrees below average, which means cold conditions, upper 30s, low 40s through dinner time, with the cloud cover and wind speed increasing overnight into tomorrow. Expect a breezy day tomorrow with a few scattered rain showers in the morning and afternoon. Our highs near 50, but it will feel much colder with the breeze. We'll dry out Thursday, and then that third and uh, final storm system of this series moves through on Friday, bringing widespread rain before we dry out this weekend. Danny, thank you. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can always get the latest news at KTNV.com.